Okay, so this is our new water heater. The one that was, this is a new 40 gallon propane. The one that was in here was a 30 gallon mobile home tank. 28 years old. Still worked fine. No issues with it whatsoever. No leaks, no nothing. Ran, no issues. The same vent was vented in with the propane heater as well. No issues. So we buy this new one because we figured, you know, 27, 28 years old, it's about time to, it's gonna, going to not work real well. Put this one in, hook it up, and have had nothing but problems on top of problems. It would keep water hot for a week, a day, two days, three days, two hours. I guess these can be finicky, this new electronic system here. I did everything I could. And I called the company and they kept telling me, venting issue, venting issue, venting issue. Disconnect the heater. Run a pipe all the way through there. You can notice my uh, custom aluminum foil to cap off from the heater. But uh, nothing worked, nothing worked. So I got my multimeter. Held the button down. Supposed to wait 90 seconds. Put the two probes in here. You're supposed to get 350 millivolts. Randomly, I would, and it would light. And recently, it w wouldn't put out more than 50. Put out nothing for at least 90 seconds. If you go over the 90 seconds, you'd get a little here, a little there. Um, so, I've been on the phone with them several times, and it's like pulling teeth trying to get them to send you new parts. But, we haven't had hot water for the last few days, and I just took a shower... Extremely exhilarating. Extremely exhilarating. Uh, my daughter has been taking them. Same thing, complaining. Well, finally, I got him to send me the new thermopile. So we will be installing that tonight. So hopefully we'll have some hot water. Just all the fun and games of buying a house, not knowing what you're up for. And the, uh, I don't know what I'd call it, the uh, problems with everything new. Everything's idiot proof. Everything's got to be so safe, so safe, so safe. It doesn't work half the time. Sick of it. They don't make anything that lasts either. This thing will probably last, it's got a six year warranty. It'll probably last six, seven years, maybe. Where I just took out a 27 year, 27 your old one. It's just insane. Anyways, just wanted to post that up. That's one more of our projects. Oh, and we also put this uh, system in. It's flood stop. Wires into the water inlet. And if it senses any moisture whatsoever in this little pad down here, it completely shuts that valve off. And beeps and makes a bunch of noise. So, my downstairs won't get flooded. If the, I mean, it cuts the pressure. You could potentially, if the hole was big enough, you could drain 40 gallons in here. But I have um, lost a water heater in a house before. And the concrete was not drained properly out through the garage. It was sloped into the house while I was on vacation and that was not fun so if uh, anybody's concerned about that and doesn't have a good pan or a good system to drain water if you have an issue this will shut off the power and I think I paid 150 bucks for it plugs into the wall super easy to install uh, I would definitely keep one of those said it's a flood stop they make quite a few different products and you can actually uh, set up a wi-fi to your phone i 
it'll alert you if it senses any moisture. All right, well, I'm going to tackle this project and see how it goes.